This is an urban slum community of 400 plus families living near Manipal, Karnataka. They are mostly migrants and are employed as daily wage laborers, others owning small petty shops or working as contractors for small construction projects. The settlement has makeshift houses with very poor access to basic amenities like toilets, electricity and drinking water. ಮೊದಲಿಗೆ ನಾವು ಕರೆಂಟ್ ಇಲ್ಲದ ಮನೆಯನ್ನು ಐಡೆಂಟಿಫೈ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇರುವಾಗ ಒಂದು ಅರವತ್ತು ಕರೆಂಟ್ ಇಲ್ಲದ ಮನೆ ಒಂದು ಈ ತರ ಸ್ಲಮ್ ಸಿಕ್ಕಿದೆ ನಮಗೆ ದಿ ಕಮ್ಯುನಿಟಿ ವಾಸ್ ಅಪ್ರೋಚ್ ಬೈ ಸೆಲ್ಕೋ ಇನ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಏಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಪ್ರೊವೈಡಿಂಗ್ ಸೋಲಾರ್ ಪವರ್ಡ್ ಲೈಟಿಂಗ್ ಸಿಸ್ಟಮ್ಸ್ ದ ಸರ್ಚ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅ ಫೈನಾನ್ಸಿಂಗ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ನರ್ ವಾಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಡಿಫಿಕಲ್ಟ್ ವಿತ್ ಸೆಲ್ಕೋ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಅಪ್ರೋಚ್ ನಿಯರ್ಲಿ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಫೈನಾನ್ಷಿಯಲ್ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಿಟ್ಯೂಷನ್ಸ್ ಈಚ್ ರಿಫ್ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಬೇಸ್ಡ್ ಆನ್ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಡಾಕ್ಯುಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಕೊಲ್ಯಾಟ್ರಲ್ಸ್ perceived high risk of the community and transaction costs for a small loan eventually selco approached an upcoming financial institution in the area hamsa chaitanya cooperative society selco provided a security deposit initially for the first 10 customers but this was gradually phased out upon seeing the regular repayments of the community a champion banker who was willing to take risk and with a good relationship developed by selco staff today 78 residents here have availed solar lighting systems hamsa chaitanya sahardha great cooperative society the flexibility of the cooperative bank enabled it to design a loan product that was tailored to the cash flow of the end user and was not constrained by the usual documentation requirements of other financial institutions further the managers of the cooperative society personally visited the site to understand the community dynamics and were confident of the people's ability to pay a sum of rupees 8000 to 15000 was provided for each for a total of 78 lighting systems the bank devised a collection mechanism with an agent hired by the bank to go to the community for collection rather than have people come to the bank every week with solar being the first type of loan received from a formal financial institution subsequently Loans were extended by the same institution for purchasing vehicles for transport business, construction equipment and for personal needs like marriages and medical expenses. The community now is more aware of basic financial planning. Over 200 savings accounts have been opened by residents. Here, most of the children attend local government schools. A small play school was also set up within the settlement. Selco's initiative has helped the migrant families availing solar lighting systems through finance. The 78 households perceived as high risk are brought into the formal banking system enabling the local financial institution to finance the poor.